So I just interviewed Tom Callahan over at the National Grand Bank. He is 99 years old and they celebrated his birthday today while at work. They were nice enough to give him a cake, give him a little coffee break. So in talking to Tom, he was telling me lots of great stories and he said that he was married for 70 years and when he goes home at night, he looks at his memory book, which is consists just of pictures of his wife. And he said that she followed him all over the country while he was in the service. He served about four years in the Air Force. And when they were in Oregon, they he was transferred, he was headed home, and they decided to drive home. And a friend of his asked him, said, are you driving home? And he said, yeah, yeah, we're going to drive home. Why wouldn't we? We're going to drive across the country. Why wouldn't we? And they said, because there are no signs. And he said, there's no signs. And, and the guy said, no. He said, they took him down because of the Japanese. Apparently, they didn't want the Japanese to have directions if they landed in the United States. He said, so how are you going to get home? And he's like, well, he said, I'm just going to head east. He's like, I figure if the sun's coming up in front of me, if, as long as the sun's in front of me, he said, we're doing okay. He said, and you know what? He goes, once I hit the Mississippi River, I knew exactly where I was going. And we got home just fine. Took us six days to drive across the country. So that's my little story behind the story. That's one of those little fun little facts that we learn when we're doing interviews that don't always make it into your story, but they kind of color your story anyway, because most of the people we interview, especially Tom, are very colorful people. See ya.